So Joe here wants me to explain shale production, which is the vast majority of oil production in the United States, and when it will be profitable again for oil companies to expand drilling. What you see happening right now is there is steady growth in the oil and gas industry. We're picking up more drilling rigs, more wells are being drilled, but the growth is slower than usual, and here's why. In 2018, when Donald Trump got OPEC to increase output by 2 million barrels a day, he really damaged the oil and gas industry really bad. So they started taking hits in late 2018 when he crashed the market by increasing oil production. 2019 was only worse. 2020, COVID, oil companies just lost their ass. So we're not even a year removed from that. So what's happening right now is they're being, they're being very cautious and they're taking profits, um, just producing existing fields. They're not drilling a ton more wells, but they're being much more conservative with their money because they're trying to get back the billions and billions and billions of dollars they lost under the Trump administration. So new investment in oil and gas has dropped dramatically, even though the industry is growing. The thing about shale production in the United States, in order to just sustain daily production at the same rate, you have to drill a lot of wells because they have a very steep production decline. So you drill and complete a new well, and let's say it comes on and it produces a thousand barrels of oil a day. Well, within six months to a year, that well is only producing two or three hundred barrels of oil a day. And that effect kind of dominoes because you have to drill another well to make up for the lost production of that well. And then that happens again and again and again. So you have to drill thousands of wells a year just to maintain the exact same production. And to increase production, you have to drill wells like crazy. Like you have to be drilling probably close to 10,000 wells a year to keep a steady increase in production. One of the changes in the oil and gas industry we're seeing right now is small oil companies going back into old and mature aging fields and bringing old wells back to life. It's a very quick process, it's a cheap process, and it's extremely profitable. And this is what the company that I work for now is doing. Um, we, We take old wells that are severely depleted and we move up whole and we recomplete them. This is a big part of the future of the oil and gas industry. It's not necessarily just going to be drilling new wells. It's going to be bringing old fields back to life because there are old reserves that are left behind.